Hello fellow gamers and playing Fallout 4 and today we're doing another settlement tour. Uh, this time we're at Green Top Nursery. Let's wait till it finishes auto saving. As you can see I've put a wall around this settlement as well. We have our defence towers all on the outside as well, protect it, protect the settlement. Managed to squeeze a, a trader post in here as well. I'm fine, thanks. Why are they complaining about the bed situation when there is plenty of beds? I don't get it. Let's see how many beds there actually is. Twenty-five people, thirty-three beds. So why are they complaining? I don't get it. More than enough beds. This is where I decided to put all the the stores. Our usual three bars. Crops been growing pretty good. Clinics, clothing, general, all of the, my guards have all got gorse rifles, all my settlements and heavy com polymer combat armour as well with a uh, armoured military fatigues or army fatigues or dirty army fatigues Back hurts, feet hurt, everything hurts. Aww, a shame and we have a junkyard dog at this settlement as well only one of I think two that I got I did have one at the slog I think as well I think that one got killed. Easy living, this ain't. Uh, plenty of food and water anyway. I'll check them bottle caps. We have the usual extra items, extra water and food, extra weapons and whatever they wear at this settlement just in case a new settler does appear and our cabinet with a couple hundred of all the various items so I can just take all of it and repair anything if, if I don't have the actual scrap items in my workshop to repair say um, turrets or or anything else And ghouls, I, I don't like, I find their eyes freaky, so I, they, they all wear welding goggles at every settlement because I just, I don't know, I still find it creepy. And inside we have. I don't remember the last time I had clean fingernails. If you work, you eat. It's as simple as that. Oh, there is a potato there. I did have. Um, a couple of tables where these three beds are here at the back with uh, various food and water on them but they just kept being either falling through the table or being knocked over by settlers so I thought well I'll put beds there and take the tables out actually I need some supplies for the road let's see what I can spare no Got work to do can't talk now 
More beds in there. We've got beds everywhere. Beds in here. I'll put the 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 because um, you get the normal beds that are quite wide, and I put these narrow beds in here so I could get more in. And lovely clean toilet. Not. <laughs> That's no way. Only thing I don't like about this is it's only got one entrance exit. So if they stand in the doorway, there's not a lot you can do about it other than fast travel away and travel back again. Why is this always open? I have it open it in the way so the Brahmin can't let itself out because it seem to do that. A little cooking station, a couple of benches for people to sit on and there is some like super mutants that live over there so sometimes get attacked from this direction so I have a few points on the wall where I can actually get up and to defend the settlement water pumps I don't have any of the DLC, so I can't have those uh, water purifiers that are on land. Water pumps, and we have our power armor. It's every settlement, or at least one at every settlement. A few settlements have got a couple out, and I have more than a couple at Sanctuary, but uh, that will be in another tour. Chemistry station, weapons workbench, and armour. And I have, have these all settlements as well. Some more water, water pumps. block this bit off here as well because when the salmon was getting attacked these seem to get hit along this side for some reason and damaged and we have a greenhouse with all the crops in See, I even give him a radio to listen to music. For trouble, I hope. And there we have it. That is Green Top Nursery. There's no one assigned to that. Oh, there is somebody assigned to it. No. Oh. Don't want to scrap it. <laughs> well, many thanks for watching. I wish to see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye for now.